Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to solve question number 15 of exercise 5.2. And the question says, for what value of n are the nth term of two APs 63, 65, 67 and 3, 10, 17 are equal? Means two APs are given to you and this AP is increasing by 2 and this, incre this AP is increasing by 7. So this is the increment this, in this AP is more than this AP. So obviously in, uh, in the, uh, this, at some point of time the terms of this AP can be equal to the terms of this AP. You have to find at what at which term the values of this AP and this AP are equal. So suppose that the nth term of this AP and the nth term of this second AP, supposing the nth term of this is Bn are equal. So you have to find for what value of n these two terms are equal. So for this the nth term will be the first term minus n minus 1 into d this is the formula we know and for this the nth term will be b into n minus 1 into d2 because the first term is also different for these two terms and the common difference is also different for these two terms so this is first difference and this is second difference so for this the first term is 63 n minus 1 you have to find out and for this the common difference is 2 and for this the first term is 3 n minus 1 you have to find and in this case the common difference is 7. Now I can solve these two equations. This will remain as it is. I can open this bracket for that we have to multiply 2 with both the terms. 2 multiplied by n will be 2n and 2 multiplied by minus 1 will be minus 2. Similarly here also I have to open the bracket and these will be the equation. Now to solve these kind of linear equation what I have to do is I have to shift all the constant to one side and all the variables to one side. Uh, before that I can solve these two constants further 63 minus 2 will be 61 plus 2n will remain as it is. This will be 7n will remain as it is and 5 minus, uh, 7 minus 3 is 4. Now what I have to do is this is a small variable then this so I can shift this to this side and I can shift this constant to this side so 61 minus value will be plus and this 2 value will be minus so 7 minus 2 is 5 and 61 plus 4 is 65 so if I want to find the value of n what I have to do is I have to divide this by 5 so this will be 5 1 times and 5 3 times so here the value of n is 13 meaning this is the first term, second term, third term and fourth, fifth, sixth and so on. The 13th term of this AP and similarly first, second, third and so on and the 13th term of this AP are, will be equal. So this is how we can solve this question. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel and if you have any problem in maths, you can contact us. The phone number and the email address is given below in the description. Thank you.